Good morning guys. Welcome to the garden this morning. Welcome aboard if you're new. I'm Todd and this morning what we're going to be doing is repotting this adenium right here which has a flower on it. This is that one for Libby. All right so anyway um, this is the, the base medium that I use. Uh, I typically use cocoa coir as my base, but it's kind of hard to get up here in Citrus County, and I'm not driving a hundred miles to get a sack of cocoa coir, so I just went ahead and do this, but I amend it as I do cocoa coir anyway, so um, anyway, I got some down in here, and what we're going to do is amend it with some extra sand, all right, so let's drag this over here. As you can see, play sand. Yeah, pretty, almost got enough here. Okay, so also in this, I have some Osmocote, whatever the standard Osmocote is. So. And I'm going to be putting turfus in. Now I'll put up a picture of the turfus bag, what this stuff is. Um, usually it's used in baseball fields and um, it's a soil additive. And then over here we got some oyster shell and granite or grit for chickens. So that's a brand, both of them are the same brand oyster shell and the granite and something's landing on me okay so I'm gonna go ahead and mix this soil I'm gonna pause um, like I said this is just that some sand and osmocote and there's also a little bit of the turfus and everything in there so how much is you know I just go by eye I don't really um, I don't really measure out too much, but, so, there we go, I'm just going to put all that in, and let me get this, anyway, yeah, you can get this at a feed store, like Tractor Supply, and all that, so, just to let you guys know. And I'm out of the oyster shell. That's the white stuff right there. All right, so there we have it. And I guess I'm going to need a pot too, right? So anyway, that's the pot. All right, I'm going to pause. Actually, I'll start up another clip. I'm just going to give this a mix around. Okay, so we're all mixed up here in the um, the uh, pan here um, with the soil. And remember, what I put in here was miracle Grow cactus and palm, but I amended it with more sand, Osmocote, about two capfuls of Osmocote, and uh, the container of the Osmocote, it has a cap on it. I put about two caps in that um, for the whole batch here. And um, the turfus, the granite, and the oyster shell. And there's probably a few pieces of lime rock up in this too. So anyway, we're going to backfill it to about up to here. About up to right there. And I'll be right back and we'll have the plant out of the container. It's already been out, so it's it's due for a repot. Okay, there we go. Now this is ready to rock and roll. And we just set it in there like that. There we 
we go. I could have centered it a little better, but oh well. <laughs> And it's not going to need watering because I'm not going to water that in because it's going to rain. All right. So anyway, now the next repotting, what would do, I would normally do if I wasn't going to give this away, I would be raising that up a bit. The caudex, this, I would be raising that up somewhat. So, all right, that's that. And I guess I'm going to do another video here and show you the new plants and get one of those potted up too or both of them potted up so really cool plants so alrighty guys that's gonna wrap this up and uh it's gonna rain this afternoon so like i said i'm not even gonna bother watering that in but that is totally potted up so and there you go if you have any questions just leave me a comment um and i'll answer it um i'll try and put the recipe or whatever in the description or whatever for the um media pretty basic stuff though um with any kind of desert plant you want really well draining medium um potting medium so there you go that's really well draining or should be anyway so already we'll see you in the next video love and peace and keep it growing